components in avenue show those are duplicate uh, and broadcast both are different component and there are uh, there are uh, some similarities and also uh, the difference basically so many a times in interview uh, people, uh, the interviewer asks the questions what is the difference between duplicate and bro broadcast and also we are going to see the exact and the uh, important use cases of replicate and broadcast replicate we uh, normally knows uh, uh, but broadcast uh, we uh, normally don't use it basically so we are going to see the exact and high performing you know the optimized way of using broadcast with respect to uh, you know uh, data processing in any issue so you are going to see that while introducing broadcast it will you know multiply the performance of the uh, particular graph we are going to build upon okay so uh, let's talk about uh, the what replicate does as a theoretically and then we are going to see how uh, does uh, it you know behaves uh, within a graph so replicate is a uh, first of all it is an uh, you know both components basically uh, tries to uh, incorporate the parallelism in the graph so one is uh, you know this uh, replicate okay this uh, enhances the data uh, so, sorry component parallelism we have three type of parallelism right so one of the parallelism is component parallelism so this enhances the component parallelism okay so we have three type of parallelism right Com uh, component parallelism data parallelism and pipeline parallelism so uh, this enhances the component parallelism so what it does is it uh, you know it emits the record into the you know different you know, state flows okay it will accept the record from the input flow and it will be uh, it will be uh, providing the same output um, for the multiple layout okay multiple uh, flow in the output so it will be emitting the input straight to the separate pipeline basically so there will be a you know multiple pipelines we can uh, we can create after the replicate and they will be you know all the record would be replicated in each flow okay so emitting the input to multiple output okay pipelines we are going to see how uh, pictorially you know in picture how it looks like okay and uh, second thing is it allows multiple outputs to um, from a given input okay allows it's basically the same same statement output allows multiple multiple output um, you know for a given layout and the same layout is going to be you know same layout and the same layout is going to be propagated to the outputs okay layout in the sense of uh, whether it is a multi you know um, multi layout or the serial layout so the same layout layout is layout is going to to be propagated okay propagated in the output okay then we have a broadcast let's see what broadcast we are going to see in, uh, in graph okay within a minute or so so uh, the sec broadcast broadcast so this uh, replicate you know enhances the component parallelism and broadcast in the data parallelism so basically it is a partitioning component so first of property is uh, uh, you know it enhances the so it's for data parallelism okay. and and what it does is it accepts the data and using the fan out flow you, we have multiple flows right fan out all tool and straight so using the fan out or all tool with any of it depending upon the you know our uh, design of the graph or, or, uh, or structure of the graph okay architecture of the graph it will be behaving differently 
so uh, using n out flow or old world flow it would be um, enhancing the data parallelism okay it will be multiplying the input records into multiple uh, data parallel way okay and second property of it is uh, it is a partitioning component basically it is in a partitioning component and what it does is it, it transition it will be transitioning the layout of the input layout to the output layout uh, meaning so if we have a straight flow coming in to the uh, broadcast and we have you know multiple uh, multiple layout you know in the target so what it does is it will be uh, transitioning from one layout to the another so one is in the left hand side we have serial layout in, meaning in the input we have a serial input coming in and the output we have a you know, four way parallel so that what it does is it will be transitioning from because it is a partitioning components what partitioning component it does is it will be uh, creating the multiple parts you know so let's say we have a partition by t component or partition by round round component so it will be partitioning the data accordingly okay depending upon the target layout similarly broadcast also does the same thing so it will be transitioning the transitioning the layout okay so these are the two you know simple properties of these components there are similarities and there are different behaviors so what are the similarities and how does uh, it behaves differently we are going to see in the architecture or in the design of the graph so let's switch on to the simple pictorial view uh, of design basically so we uh, let's see in the left hand side we have picture a and right hand side i have picture b so let's say uh, how you know differently these replicate and broadcast behaves uh, depending upon the structure of the graph or depending upon the architecture of the graph so what we have in the input in the first uh, picture a is and this is a serial input okay one way you can say and we have a target is n way in the sense of these are multi files in the target and we have serial in the input so if we connect the you know with the replicate so what it will be behaving is a there will be a on uh, by default uh, n out flow uh, you know uh, if we connect you know simply then by default the n out flow will be uh, will be seen in the after the replicate okay so what it does is if we have 10 10 records in the serial then it will be you know it will be fan out and it will be a, if we have a four way output okay so there will be 40 records coming out from the replicate okay because the target is the multi uh, multi way or fan way so it will be you know proper uh, so because there is a by default behavior of the replicate is when we connect simply then it will be you know fan out flow coming in coming out okay if we have a serial layout in the left hand side and we have a parallel layout in the output side and in case of broadcast okay in the broadcast we have a serial layout source layout in the serial and the, and the target layout is you know n way or multi way so if we have a 10 records into, into the input and we have we will be getting you know 40 records into the output the by default behavior of the broadcast in this scenario would be fan out flow uh, in the output okay so this will be exact same behavior okay in this uh, this you know context this structure or this architecture okay uh, in contrary okay if you see the right hand side we have a uh, you know we have a multi-way input and we have a multi-way output okay let's say we have a four-way input and we have a four-way output if okay in this structure if we if we you know uh, if we include or if we insert the replicate component between these uh, input and output how replicate will be you know diverting output flow would be straight flow so in this case uh, the let's say we have 40 records you know in different partitions of the four way of input the similarly similar 40 record would be copied okay in each partition there will be 10 records let's say in the input then the only only those 10 records would be in the uh, output okay so there is there is a because there is a default behavior in this scenario is going to be a straight flow coming out from the replicate component therefore there will be a no multiplication of the record so all the records uh, as it is coming in from the source would be going out of, from the uh, output flow of the replicate now 
if we in the failure uh, circumstances if we you know insert the broadcast component among between these uh, you know input and output the broadcast would be uh, behaving as a partitioning component which basically the data would be repartitioned you know then uh, because so all the 40 records would be uh, multiplied by 4 into 160 code is going to be in the output so each partition will uh, will be each partition of the output you know will have um, 40 records because all the 40 records coming in from the input would be going into the each partition basically so the in by default behavior in this context would of broadcast would be you know all to all flow this is called all to all flow this cross and you know if you look at the actual uh, uh, ab initio graph design when you uh, use these components you will see uh, there will be you know there are some pictures i mean the flow would be shown indicated as a cross like this okay so this is uh, you know this is fan out this is fan out this is straight flow and this is all to all flow there is a fan in flow as well okay that we are going to see in some other day okay so this is uh, uh, okay this we have discussed so uh, can we uh, forcefully uh, you know alter the behavior of these components or alter the behavior alter alter these you know flows yes we can do if we alter uh, to make it you know um, fan out or you know alter or flow then the both the components can behave differently i mean we can make broadcast to behave like replicate in this scenario and also we can make replicate to behave like broadcast okay so this we can do so i think uh, for today or for this particular video we have talked about uh, enough uh, regarding uh, replicate and broadcast but in the next session of uh, video we are going to see the actual use cases of broadcast so we are going to see two use cases which are going to be very very important and they are uh, they are mul multiple times they are you know uh, proved as a uh, you know uh, enhancing the performance of the graph basically because uh, if we are dealing with the uh, uh, you know uh, billions of records in some times you know in some of the applications right so then you know this uh, this kind of parallel com parallelism you know you know we have in have initial we have parallelism so parallelism is going to be uh, you know play you know key role in uh, processing these billions of records okay so thank you so much uh, please subscribe my channel and uh, you can propagate this video to uh, multiple people of uh, your non people who may be you know seeking uh, some help in abinishu in time to come we are going to see many more videos thank you so much